Brian Hayes here, Castle Champions. I'm here with Frank Hickman, former wrestler at Laney High School in Wilmington. He's from Castle Haynes, North Carolina, which is like like the outskirts in Wilmington. Uh, wrestled at Bloomsburg, uh, assistant wrestling coach, former assistant wrestling coach at Appalachia under John Mark Bentley. Head of wrestling coach at Tiger Muay Thai in Thailand. Uh, you know, Israel Adesanya, that's one of the guys that he helps out. So everybody knows who that is, champion. Um, Frank's here helping out with a camp here in Wilmington. Uh, so, hey, man, catch us up. What, what you been up to, man? I've been spent the last almost four years. It'll be four years in May. Uh, moved to Phuket, Thailand. Uh, wrestling coach at Tiger Muay Thai with my brother. My brother was in MMA. So uh, then I was able and fortunate enough to get my hands in and work with uh, gyms along the lines of city kickboxing in Auckland, New Zealand. Uh, freestyle fight club out of Wollongong, Australia with a couple of the boys. And I'm able to travel the world and coach up, you know, several guys that come through the gym, you know, from Russia, everywhere, all over the world. Uh, I was in Vegas for a month, the boys had some fights, and then I was able to sneak out for about a week and a half to come home and see the folks before I head back. It's been about a year and a half since I've been home. And of course, Boomer Boyd, um, I've known Boomer since I was about six years old. He, he started wrestling the same year, he was about three years old. He wrestled in Missouri, Duke University, now he runs a successful youth program slash high school program out of uh, Wilmington, North Carolina, out of his dad's spot near Riceville Beach. So anytime I'm in town, I'm always keen to get back and help Boomer whenever I can because, you know, he's a good buddy of mine. And um, he's running a great program. He's got a lot of good kids here. So it's good for the area. It's good for the state. So you mentioned giving back, man. How does it make you feel to be able to just get back here, man? It's good. It's always good. You know, there's no place like home, they say. Uh, Riceville Beach, Cash Lane, special place on my heart. Um, but it's even better now that Boomer has this going. You know, Boomer's had this going for several, several months now. And I just saw it through Facebook, Instagram, back when I was in Thailand. Now that I'm here and I can actually see it, he has a good system going. So I'm very excited for him to see what he can do with these kids and how can he can impact them, where he can get them, you know, help them get to their goals. So you're, uh, I forgot to mention, he's the uh, younger brother of George Hickman, uh, Riverside Laney product. Uh, how has George been, man? He doesn't talk a lot, man. I don't hear much about him. He's good. He's got a, he's got a daughter now. She's, she's just turned two and a half. But he's in Thailand as well. He's been there longer than I have. He's been there about, coming up on seven years. Uh, he's the head MMA coach, but we work together, uh, so he's doing very well. Um, we got a girl fighting May 1st in Vegas, so he'll go to Vegas for about two weeks or so. So we're excited about that. And yeah, we just got training the guys and girls with fights coming up. You know, he focuses more on the MMA part, I focus more on the wrestling part for it. So it works well for us. And like I said, I don't know if he'll be fortunate enough to sneak out and get home this time around, but you know, um, anytime he can is good. Well, you know, you got the uh, Hickman brothers over there as well. I like to yeah. say, perfect uh, combination. Frank, thanks for your time, and man, good luck with what you got going on. Thank you, Ron.